here, people? I'm here. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's AJ. So I just finished watching Raw, and I have to say, the show was really good to me. There are a couple of angles that, you know, I'm just really liking, and I had predicted that they would strip Daniel Bryan of the title. I also predicted that they would fire the referee. Both of those things ended up happening. That was at the beginning of the show. Then another thing that was really cool to me was the angle with Stephanie McMahon and Dusty Rhodes. That angle right there was just so good to me. It was like, it just makes you want to keep watching. You know, she was just being a complete bitch to him. Then they forced the Big Show to KO punch him, which I thought was great. And then the Big Show's out there crying again. I don't know why they're doing this to the Big Show, but just with them forcing him to do stuff is just so funny to me. I, I just find it so hilarious. So he, he KO punches um, Dusty Rose, and then he hugs him and is crying and stuff like he always does. It was just so good. The next thing was we had Ryback come out with Paul Heyman, and they were talking and this and that. It was kind of weird to me that Paul Heyman kissed him. He kissed him on the cheek. I mean, I don't have anything against gay people, but you remember the thing with him and CM Punk. He was like, I loved you and all this stuff like that. And now he's kissing Ryback on the cheek. On the cheek. It, just, it just seems gay. But, you know, it is what it is. Hopefully, you know, Ryback will eventually get better. And I noticed that the fans were still chanting Goldberg the whole time, which I thought was hilarious, too. And they're just the Goldberg chant seems to be getting louder. So that's a good thing to me. Hopefully they'll bring back Goldberg. But um, we had the who was it? Randy Orton attack the Miz. He was going at it with Triple H and Stephanie McMahon and talking all kinds of crap because they didn't give him the title back. And they said they'll find someone else to be the champion. It's just really good right now. Then at the end of the show, we had the Shield attacking Daniel Bryan after a match he had with Roman Reigns. And next thing you know, Randy Orton's about to punk kick him. And the whole locker room comes out to his rescue and just starts beating the crap out of the shield and everything. That was really good to me. I really loved the way the show ended, and I thought it was just great. So, anyways, that's my review of the show. I thought it was really good. Let me know what you think about the show. Also, subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Check out my Facebook and Twitter. The link's in the description. Also in the description is a link to my second channel. Be sure to check that out. And until next time, peace. Bye.